that was a massive shit. So anyways, yeah, I took a massive shit. Does anybody ever get those shits where it's just like, I don't even know how to explain it. Like you get, you go to sit down on the toilet or before you sit down on the toilet, it's like playing peekaboo with your butthole. And then you go to sit down on the toilet and at this point it's, it's sitting there, but it won't come out. So then you literally have to strain to get it out. Yeah, that was me this morning. Every now and again, I think like once or twice a year, I have those kinds of shits and it hurts. It probably doesn't hurt as much as a woman having a, a having going into labor and having a baby, but that shit hurts. Like I could literally feel my asshole stretching. Probably just gave y'all a really bad visual. Um, but yeah. Oh, there goes my finger. Oh, there's my finger again. Oh, Lord. I love playing around with this cinematic view. Yeah, I'm stupid. It's just cool enough out here that every time I let out my vape smoke, my vapor, my vapor, not vape smoke, vapor. God, I don't know why I can't even do, why I can't say that right every time. <laughs> But it's so dense. I hardly ever get that. <coughs> yeah, you could say we like microfiber towels around here. The amount of microfiber towels is just wow. Can't really show you the brand because you don't know where I work, but it's a nice little deal. The catch all. big green behemoth I've been driving. Ooh, look at the fog. Those aren't clouds, that's fog. See, more fog. More fog in the distance. It's trying to zoom in. It won't let me zoom in. Why is it acting funny? Huh, that's weird. Waiting for that fog to move. Just to see if there's another heavenly body in the sky. I guess not. I'm gonna try a reverse video. Let's see how this goes. Do something, I'm always 
I whipped out that inverter, plugged it in, plugged the cord in, because, um, what's cool, I don't know, I may have to look into selling my, my Belkin, I may have to sell my Belkin. person's nice and they say oh I have a stupid question that doesn't bother me the fact of the matter is when people actually walk in my job and go well I, I, I need a fuel cap oh that no that's one of them so they'll tell me the year making 
model and then there's some of them are just like I need a fuel cap for that car right there okay what's that car right there you're the car person don't you know I know what it is but you gotta give me a sufficient year because sometimes they change stuff up you don't know what you're driving I was like is that even your car well yeah How do you not know what you're driving? Oh. Just give me this blank stare. Like, how the hell am I supposed to know? Well, you're driving it. It's like, even before I worked for an auto parts store, like, I could literally look at a car and know what it is. And then some of these people are just too fucking high to even. Stinking up the damn store. All kinds of shit. Like, bruh. How do you not know what the hell you're driving? I just don't understand it. I guess people really just like to piss me off for no, for no reason. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification icon. And when you hit the bell notification icon, there'll be a little menu that pops up. If you hit all, it will literally notify you for all of my future videos. It will pop up in your notifications whenever I get ready to post a new video or whenever a new video is about to, pre about to premiere. It's time for me to make my smoothie and go about my day, get ready to go to work.